Good morning, everybody. So I'm about to leave my house and head to MacDill. So once I get there, I will be back on. Okay, so I just got to this parking lot outside of base. There's this little building where you have to get a pass as a visitor. Um, so you bring your DD4 form from MEPS and your ID. So let's see what they say. Okay, so I just got my visitor pass. It took about five minutes, but I got there before the line. So if you ever do come here, definitely get here early just in case. Um, but it was quick and easy. And then she gave me just a piece of paper with a bunch of information on it. Hey everybody, so I just parked at the gym. Um, it takes a couple minutes to get here because the base is pretty big. Um, I also got lost a little bit, but that's normal because I've only been here a couple times. So I'm gonna make a video after of the track in the gym here because I don't wanna bring my phone inside and then have to come back out to my car and be like, oh, why'd you bring your phone? You know, you probably shouldn't have brought it in. So, um, Yep, it's really foggy right now anyway, so if I was to show you guys the track, you wouldn't really see it. And there's two tracks here. So. Okay, so the first time I ran on the track here, they have two. They have, like, an older one, and then they have, like, a new one that's, like, turf and the artificial grass and stuff. So I ran on that one, and it turns out that the newer track is a little bit smaller than the old one. Um, so when you do a PT test here, it's the old track that they use because six laps is a mile and a half. Um, on the new track, it's six and three fourths of a lap to do the mile and a half. Um, and I'll show you guys the map now because I do not know. Okay, so we just finished. It's one o'clock almost. Um, we started a little bit late. A lot of people got lost. Um, so we met inside the gym and then we went outside and we did our sit-ups for one minute and then we did our push-ups for one minute. And then they gave us a 10 minute break. Um, it's really hot here today. And then we went out to the track to run. So um, obviously we ran on the bigger track like I posted earlier the picture of. Um, I ran 14 minutes and 28 seconds which is still really good. I ran better the other day, but it was really hot. After that, we did a cool down lap, just walking, and then we went back inside, and that was it for today. And then I just bought a smoothie because they have... Um, in the beginning, they also took our weight. Um, I am currently 130. My goal is to get back down to 120. I was at that weight probably two years ago, so I'm just going to keep running a lot. I'm still in the under way under the, the requirements so I'm fine but there's always room for improvement uh, for my sit-ups I did 48 sit-ups which was actually really great because I didn't do that many last week when I PT myself and then for push-ups I did 21 so um, another thing was today we were going by week four I believe of what we do in BMT when you leave um, like the standards for the run, the sit-ups, and the push-ups. And obviously this is different for guys than it is for women. Um, so today the minimum was only 10 push-ups and 16 sit-ups. And the run was like 16.45. So um, obviously I got past all that because my goal is to exceed the regular standards. To just be prepared, over-prepared, or whatever. To make my life easier when I'm there. So in case you're wondering what smoothie I got, I got a small. The smoothies are pretty big on base, so I definitely was not going to get a medium. Um, so I got the vanilla weight loss protein with strawberry and banana and fat burner. As so I hope you guys liked my video. Um, I don't think our next one in a couple weeks is going to be a PT test again, but if it is or if it's anything that's important, then I will definitely make another video.